October 2007. A violent downpour pelts a small town near Spain's Atlantic coast. Within 20 minutes, the fast-moving floodwaters reach depths of up to two feet, sending residents fleeing for safety and sweeping away everything in its path. More than 40 houses and businesses are under siege. Shop owners struggle to keep rising waters from overtaking their stores. But the powerful current carries away anything that isn't bolted down. Resident Jose Manuel Marquez finds himself trapped in his car as it's pelted by wind, rain, and hail. Rising waters have turned the street into a surging river, threatening to sweep away Jose and other drivers as they helplessly sit in their cars. Jose is unable to move to safer ground due to the unfolding chaos just ahead. On the town's main street, the debris chokes torrent, swamps cars, and begins to carry them away. Vehicles weighing two tons and more are no match for rushing water, now reaching depths of up to five feet. A raging mass of nearly 20 automobiles smashes against storefronts. Jose has no choice but to ride out the deluge. Fortunately, his car isn't one of the casualties. Rescue workers search the vehicles for any survivors that may be trapped inside. It later takes heavy machinery to dismantle the wall of cars. Two people lose their lives, and the Spanish government declares the town a disaster area. Damages from this storm reach $5 million.